Uh, redirection is much more effective than simply trying to stop behavior, right? Redirection is like close a door, open a window, right? So instead of just saying don't do that when your dog starts to pick up your shoe or chew on something, you're not, give them something else to do. Redirect their energies into another activity, much more effective than simply trying to make them stop. So be prepared to redirect, which means pre preparedness on your part. Like around the house, I've got things that the, are acceptable to the dog to chew on and things like that. So if I say, hey, not that, I've got something convenient. I carry toys and food on me all the time with my puppies. We're gonna talk about being prepared with your puppy. Like if I take my puppy out, I never don't have stuff on me with puppies. Literally, I set it up to be easy when I'm managing my puppy. I've got crates in different spots, so I don't have to keep moving my crate. I've got a crate in my living room. I've got one in the spare room. I've got one in the car. Otherwise, you're carrying it around all the time. I'm a dog trainer, though, so I suppose. But you guys all are, too. Otherwise, you're not here. You don't casually come in here. So get more than one crate, so you don't have to keep dragging your crate around. Right? <laughs> It'll make your life infinitely easier. And then I stash treats and toys where they're convenient so that every time I go to grab my puppy, I've got them. If you have one bag of treats in your refrigerator and you're taking your puppy out of the crate in the garage to go outside, you're like, do I walk all the way back in and get it out of the fridge or do I just take my puppy out? Yeah, I'll just take my puppy out. And then your puppy starts biting your pant leg and you've got nothing and now you're like, get off me. And you're trying to find something on the ground to stick in their mouth. If I make it easy for myself, I'll do it. I have a bag of treats on top of their crate and a couple of soft toys there. Before, right before I take them out, I stick the treats in my pocket, I stick the toy down the back of my pants, and I've got it on me. I may not need it, but I have it on me every single time. I put one by the back door, one by the front door. I put one in the laundry room. I throw one on the front seat of my car, right? And so then it's easy. Every time I go to grab my puppy, right there. Make that easy for yourself and be prepared. Then you can redirect when you need to without having to go, uh-oh, right? Don't let your puppy out in the morning. You know, first thing in the morning, you get up, your puppy's gonna want out. You go grab your cup of coffee, you're still in your pajamas. You walk over, you pop your puppy out. Bad move, right? Your puppy's gonna come out all fired up first thing in the morning, yay! Pajamas, you're like, ah, coffee, ah, right? That's bad planning, right? So think, be ready to redirect at any time.